On today's video is gonna be about cleaning their tires. Right here, mainly not the wheels, but I'm gonna do the wheels at the same time. Using simple green right there on your tires. Boom. Now on this video with the simple green, I'm gonna have the kid's truck on there, clean his tires, cause his tires got the white letters. And then um, I'm gonna throw in my car, my daily driver, cause they're really dirty. A lot dirtier than these using the simple green and using the old uh, spray bottle clean it out real good use the alcohol also because it was a windex bottle and put this in there and you can dilute it also and then right there you can you know it's nice too you can buy this anywhere anywhere you want you can use it full strength you can dilute it it's got directions right there general purpose is one to one so basic example one ounce of simple green to one cup of water you want to go that route or go half and half you like but there you go you can also use it on your wheel wells with the brush right there but i'm not going to get mad today basically today's just the tires clean the tires and then what's nice too uh local store you pick this up local store and i got these brushes right here at a dollar store they were i think a dollar fifty a piece right here It'd be, works great for uh cleaning your tires right here stuff like this too you want to be careful not to get your wheel especially if they're uh finished like the charger um probably gonna want to use something a little bit softer these are pretty these have pretty good uh pretty stiff but what's nice too you can get them a local store got these at family dollar dollar fifty each right there so you can't beat that so i'm trying to do some videos like this where stuff you can pick up at your local store and save some money instead of ordering you know stuff that may be expensive you know because us it's just a hobby and plus two we always buy our stuff so we got to save some money somehow too and this is a way you guys can save some money by using local products that are safe this right here i got picked this up at myers at, um pretty sure it was 5.99 for this so yeah this will last me all season you can use it to clean anything actually so it's an all-purpose cleaner not just your tires use it clean whatever you like just not the dogs <laughs> all right let me get get going and mix it up we're gonna wet the tires down then we'll get the clean in got my bucket. And i always have a separate bucket for wheels too all my wheel stuff here i even got a grit guard in there um i probably don't need it uh who knows uh dirt guards not in the, in this bucket but oh well and uh yeah always have your separate stuff because you don't want that stuff on your paint and then after I do the wheels and tires, I'm going to wash the Jeep up. Let me get this. You do it. The, um, tires, I'm not going to use the bucket. We'll use the bucket for the wheels. I'll use some soap. Right now, this video is just going to be about the tires. Wet everything down. These tires are not bad. They pretty don't get trashed too much. Not like my car. And then just spray down your simple green. If you want to put on your wheels a little bit, you can. Get some of that brake dust off before I really clean it. And then we're gonna take our dollar store brush and clean these bad boys up. You can do the outline where you're not getting your wheels. So I have a softer brush for the wheels. I'll do that because I usually wash the wheels actually with the soap that I'm using to wash the vehicle. It does a pretty good job of cleaning. I got some other products too that I can test out for uh, wheel cleaners, and we will during the summer. That's it. We'll let it put that on there. You can see right here. I have, this is softer for your for your wheels. All right, we'll squirt it down and see how much dirt comes off using simple green. bad and we'll have to see what they look like like I said you can use it for the wheel wells too if you want use a bigger brush I have one in the in the garage all right let me do all the wheels and we'll let it dry we'll see what it looks like I'll spray in there I can't find my other brush I've been looking for I gotta clean that garage out spray in there if you want and then you can use this brush too it works pretty good get in there some of that 
Fantastic. Pretty good. We got some garlic oil. Got a nice panel. Get in there. Get on top. Not hitting your hand or anything. One way to clean it real well. Granted, you know, once it dries, you're gonna see spots that you haven't missed. You'll have to go over it probably two or three times. There you go. And do your wheel tires. The wife did to her Jeep. Check this out, man. Can you guys believe it? You guys are not gonna believe it if you've been following this channel. What? She went mall crawling. Look at that. <laughs> mall crawling. I wonder what mall she went to. <laughs> I did the wheels, I did them twice. Now I'm gonna clean the wheels first and then I'll wash the vehicle and then we'll see what it looks like when it dries. I'm gonna be applying a tire dressing too, that'd be a separate video. Um, with a different product, you can check that out later when it comes out. Um, now the Simba Green, I clean it, you know, it's gonna leave a little bit, of, it's gonna look a little, you know, dirty. I did it twice, but it cleans pretty good with the brushes, you can see it right there. Um, I haven't used any other wheel cleaner to give you an opinion on a different wheel cleaner from different companies like Adams or Chemical Guys and stuff or Garrett Garage. But that's what the results I'm getting right now. I gotta do this one one more time. Um, in my opinion, it this stuff probably not as good as a company that's making a Pacific tire cleaner product. But this is an alternative that will get them clean pretty decent, and then you can use your dressing on it. I mean, you're granted, you know, you're not going to get them clean, clean, but at least you're getting your old dressing off, you're getting some of the grime off of it, and then you can apply a new dressing, and then you have a nice coat. That's my opinion anyway. All right, I'm going to wash the wheels, wash the vehicle, and then we'll see what the tires look like dry. Okay, that's what the tires look like with the... Simple green, pretty clean, not bad. They even feel kind of clean. A little bit of dirt on there, but not too bad. They're not gonna be perfect. Just clean enough where you can get your dressing on there. So the Jeep's done. And then I just gotta show you my car and then this video will be ended. Look at that. And then I'll do a video on the dressing. Not bad for simple green in my opinion. What do you guys think? Or do you guys want it to look like brand new when you first get them? to be doing a lot of scrubbing. So simple green's great for cleaning your white letters. Since the truck has it, spray the whole tire down. We'll scrub them up. There you go. Clean the whole tire. Cleans them pretty good. Especially the white wells. So see that's a product you can pick up at your local store. You don't have to order it. You might have to clean the big tires a couple times. To get them clean. simple green I gotta hit them again I want them to dry there's a couple spots I missed right there I'll get it but that's what the white they look pretty clean let's continue to simple green on the tires cleaning the tires you can see how dirty my tires get driving to work look how dirty my vehicle gets look at that it's just it's black it's like a dark gray and that's from uh, driving an industrial environment in Detroit. Right there, look at that. Dirty it gets. Let's see that. Alright, okay, we're gonna test it out on this tire. Finish up this video. I'm gonna wet it up with simple green. We'll spray it on here. Let's see how well it goes. Sorry about that rant about testing vehicle. It just, I don't know, it just drives me nuts. Okay. Anyway, this one. 
these memory these brushes I got at the dollar store. Paid like a dollar fifty for them. In the kitchen section. And I'll super green you pretty much. I'll do it a couple times. Then we'll let it dry. Then we'll look at it. Man, this video right here for just cleaning the tires with the slip greens took me two weeks to get the footage done because it just constantly rains the last couple weeks. All right, we'll rinse it off and we'll see. Then we'll let it dry. See what it looks like. It looks like I need air. I got to go. All right, we'll let it dry and then we'll see what it looks like and this we'll see how it goes we'll let it dry that's what they look like not bad pretty good for simple green let's go look how dirty this tire is so you can compare it there we go that's it so look at the difference definitely gotta slow leak i'm gonna take that tire but see the difference as you're doing this you can check out your thing so that's it guys for the simple green and some of the brushes that i got at the dollar store right here i gotta clean that it's you know something you can get local for five dollars at myers i had went and got i bought some of these a while ago i got me my another straight bottle uh, i need to buy a straight bottle of this and you can dilute this also i went full strength for the tires and since this is almost half i'll add some water to it and it will still clean pretty good and you can use it cleaning your engine and everything and it's supposed to be safe for the environment i guess so yeah thanks for watching i appreciate it guys yeah first time here we uh test out detailing products um, we do uh, car shows in the detroit local area and stuff like that you know so you know car shows and we do some little bit of auto repair and we test you know detailing products i'm gonna start kind of throwing in products that we can get at the store so I have a habit of uh, picking up um, the stuff you order online and then testing it out because I like testing them out. Um, so if you guys, so the people don't want to order stuff, they can test it out. Buy it, you know, at the store and then test it out, stuff like that. I got tongue tied, tired from working. So all right, guys, you guys uh, have a great one, and don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Appreciate it. You guys have a great one. Thanks.